A growing network of outdoor trails are a welcome development for bicyclists, runners and walkers. The trails created through the work of Great Rivers Greenway are bringing the metro area together and making St. Louis proud. We're bikers. Yeah, more than we used to be runners, but not anymore. That was <laughs> <We're>, him. <laughs> <laughs> Whichever exercise you choose, it can all be done on the 128 miles of greenways that currently stretch throughout the St. Louis region. The Hoffmans bike a few times a week on the trail. I think it's really cool. I mean, you can get around town actually pretty quick. And with um, all the concerns on the roads nowadays, having a trail makes the safety. So that's why we actually take the extra time to drive to a trail and get on a trail just to stay away from the roads. This stretch is called the Gravoy Greenway, better known as Grant's Trail. The trail runs through South St. Louis County and goes right by Grant's farm. The Gravoy Greenway here is the most popular in the region. It has over a half a million trips taken on it each year. This stretch gives people an even longer distance to exercise, connecting South County to the city. We'll have over 21 miles continuously connected. Users will be able to go from Kirkwood to Shrewsbury Metrolink out to Jefferson Barracks County Park. It'll be an amazing connection. Recently, the last couple of years, we've added some really nice trails here. These trails allow users to connect to unique natural places outside, uh, unique historical assets throughout the region. It's a great place to connect with each other. All of the work done by Great Rivers Greenway is paid for by taxpayer approved funds and from generous private donations. The idea is to leave a legacy for future generations and something the St. Louis region can be proud of. We really want the trails to be used by everyone, uh, no matter their abilities, no matter their skills, no matter their interests. If you can take a leisurely stroll, get some fresh air, see a unique wildflower or bird, or you can be an active biker who's looking to train for a longer ride and you want to go those long distances. There's something for everyone in a greenway in the region. News 4 checked in with Great Rivers Greenway to get an update on where the Brickline Greenway project stands. The Brickline will stretch from Forest Park to the Arch Grounds, connecting more than a dozen different neighborhoods in the city. One pathway from Harristow State University to the MLS Stadium is in the design phase. After gathering input from the community, this part of the Greenway will honor the Mill Creek Valley neighborhood. Bounded by 20th Street, Grand Avenue, Olive Street, and Scott Avenue, the historically black neighborhood was at one time the home to Scott Joplin and Josephine Baker. Mill Creek Valley was home to 20,000 people in 1959 mm -hmm. when it was demolished by the city of St. Louis.